I'm Daniel Kish. I'm the president of World Access for the Blind. I lost my first eye at the age of seven months and my second eye at the age of 13 months. Echolocation is actually very simple. The physics of echolocation is very simple and easy to understand. Uh, it's similar to vision in a lot of ways. You have energy, in this case acoustic energy instead of light energy, and the energy goes out from the individual. Uh, in our case, it's the for in the form of a tongue click. Uh, and then that energy bounces off of everything in the environment, all surfaces everywhere, and comes back to the listener. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to familiarize myself with the area by clicking and listening to the returning echoes and also keeping track of where I go and where I come from. Now there's a structure here, a small one, or, well, it's a pole. Ah, I see. So now, it really does open up. Here's another pole. And this is probably a court. Yeah. So, this would be a basketball court, and there would be the hoop. For us, it's all about freedom. Freedom to choose, freedom to be, um, without conditions, without restrictions. And flash sonar is just one element of that, it's one component of that. Most blind people spend much of their time on someone's arm or holding someone's hand or being directed by others, you won't develop these skills under those conditions. We know one thing, that somewhere on the other side over there is another building. Now, let's, let's um, click to see what we hear on this side. Not so much, right? There's some things, but not nothing as pronounced as a building. So, let's step out into the parking lot and let's try to stay alive, man. Okay. Keep me alive. During the course of the workshop, we take a hands-off approach, so hands are off. No one touches him, no one guides him, no one leads him, no one tells him what to do or where to go. And that is how the navigation system of a blind person becomes repaired. Let's go out, but not yet. Listen to traffic. When, when, when it's clear, then you can go, okay? There. There's another car. Listen. Go ahead and go. Cane out, cane in front of you, and use your click. Click, stop, use your cane, short cane, you're getting close to a car, use your short cane, I don't want any of your cane touching it. Thank you. Wow! His pace has picked up, you see that Daniel? He really has. He's walking really a lot has. faster yep. now. Yep. Brian, <laughs> thank you for keeping me alive. 